Sophomore Kiera Porter led the black and gold with four titles as the Rams competed in their first ever Atlantic 10 Outdoor Championships this past weekend. Porter claimed the gold in the 200 meter, 400 meter, 4x100 relay, and 4x4 relay. For her efforts, she was named the most outstanding performer of the track and field championships. It was an accomplishment that didn't catch Porter off guard. Um, I try not to look at the rankings too much during the season, but I knew that there was a possibility that I could get all four gold. Porter has been setting school records and leading the team in just her first two years on campus. I didn't expect her to be so good so early, but I'll, I'll take it. And, um, you know, the team feeds off of her and she actually feeds off of the team. I try to take everything, you know, gratefully and just so thankful for this opportunity and being able to run so well, so young. And I'm just excited for the next two years. Her compete in high school and she always battled. She always ran hard. She's a tough competitor. So her attitude t told me she was going to be very successful. Last summer, Porter was a part of the Junior Olympic Relay team that traveled to Spain. It was a great experience representing the United States of America, um, wearing the USA on my chest. Um, it was a great eye-opener to see how fast I really am and can run with those caliber of talents. It was just a great experience. The international experience leads the question of whether Kier will try to compete for a spot on the U.S. Olympic team in 2016. Uh, the sky's the limit for her. If she wants to be in the, in the Olympics, I think she can. She's, she's going to continue to work hard. She's going to continue to grind. Um, everyone Sarah. says so, but I'm just trying to get through college first <laughs> and worry about these four years. And if that opportunity comes, I'll be greatly appreciated to run. Standing at just five foot one inch, it is uncommon to see a sprinter with this much talent at such a short stature. But Porter is motivated to leave her doubters at the starting blocks. I've never seen anyone that runs the 400 my same size at all. <laughs> now, I don't think they overlook her anymore. But when they first stepped on the track, it was this little girl. Well, who is she? I think they do. And it's like, hmm. I can run with you guys, don't, I'm, I am a competitor too. Up next for Porter is the NCAA East Regionals in Greensboro, North Carolina. You can log on to vsuathletics.com for all race information.